If we don't protect the work and the homies, I guarantee we next. You don't have what it takes to keep up with a woman like her. I know where you're at, and you know where I'll be. Henry and BMF down will at least give us some peace. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mark Dark, and I'm back with another video. If you're new, if you love BMF, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like the video, and leave your theories, comments, everything down below. Now today, we're gonna be talking about BMF Season 3, Episode 8. This is the final predictions. So down below, I want you guys to give me your final predictions for this next upcoming episode. We're gonna see Meech back in Atlanta, and we're also going to see Terry dealing with Vince. It seems like in that trailer, he's having more problems than he thought he was going to have. And as I told you guys before, it seems like Terry is always having some type of new issue. Him and Meech, no matter what. But we're going to go over those exclusive pictures. Then after that, we will go over the trailer one last time to give those final predictions. And the title of the episode is called Code Red. And the description of the episode reads, Meech returns to Elena to learn that the city in his love now belong to Glock. He's determined to take the city from his competitors, yet he learns to do this in a smart manner. So those are the key things that we're going to have to look out for in tonight's episode of BMF. I definitely cannot wait to see how it's all going to end. Now you guys, make sure you check out my last few videos. I dropped a video about Veronica Jen and Henrietta. Will this be the end for Veronica? Or will she end up taking down Henrietta? And for the Power fans, make sure you check out the Power Book 2 Ghost Could Tariq Join Tommy in Chicago. And is there another spinoff coming? A fan theory type of video? Check it out if you have not seen it. But let's go ahead and talk about the topic of discussion. Let's go over some of these exclusive pictures. Now in this first picture right here, we can see your boy Raw Doll Charles. He's getting shaped up by Terry. And it's looking like Charles is about to have his comeback episode y'all the last two ain't been good for him the doctor he's been turning up kicking it with lucille in cars giving her flowers going on dates dancing having a good old time so now your boy charles he has to come back and it's looking like he's about to perform maybe a new song maybe it's the remix to the last song that he dropped or could he be just performing the same song in front of everybody at the end of the day based off this picture Charles does look happy, so I definitely cannot wait to see how it's all going to play out. Will him and Dr. Maurice finally have, you know, a one-on-one, -on -one, a face-to-face? -face? Well, we're going to find out soon enough. Now, this picture right here, we can see Henrietta, and we can see Detective Veronica Jen, and she's getting close. We can tell that this conversation is very serious just based off Henrietta's facial expression. I told you guys, Veronica, she has to be very, very careful she cannot afford to slip up because if she does she's up out of here right and i want to know if that lenny Edwards character is going to run his mouth because he seems kind of shaky he seems like if you put enough pressure on him he may just talk so we're going to see if this game plan for veronica jen works out and if she actually listens to detective bryant he told her not to go in without him the next time well we're going to see if she's going to listen because if not that could be her downfall and speaking of Detective Bryant, look at him. He is still stressed out after the whole Kevin thing. I mean, Veronica Jen will come in and talk to him. And of course, we can tell based off that trailer, they will talk about taking down BMF and Henrietta. Now, it seems like Terry is having some problems, y'all. We already knew that this Vince character will be an issue based off the last episode. Well, based off these pictures, it seems like that is the case. And Terry... He's going to have to figure out how to neutralize this dude because if not, he will be a problem. The sad thing is Markeisha, she thinks this is all funny. She loves, you know, Terry and this Vince character going back and forth, but this could be dangerous. I mean, look at Terry. He's looking all stressed out like he does not know what to do. But let's go over this trailer one last time to get those final predictions. And based off that trailer, we know Meech will be having a conversation with Duffy. And in my final predictions, he understands that these crimes could be federal as far as, you know, moving drugs and they have to be on their P's and Q's. My final predictions will be the Red Dogs will turn up in episode eight. They're not about to be playing around with nobody 
as I told you guys in my What to Expect video, Meech, he will be watching him, trying to make sure that he is not slipping up. And also, he has to make sure that his crew does not slip up because the Red Dogs, they ain't playing around. And they hoping and praying for anybody to slip up. But y'all know it's always a weak link within the organization. Now, as we just discussed, we know that Terry will have issues with this Vince character. Marquisha, she thinks it's funny. I believe that Terry has to move in a smart way in order to get this guy up off his back because if not, this could blow up. And just like Meech has to figure out a way to neutralize his competitors, Terry has to do the exact same thing. He has to be very smart when it comes to dealing with this guy. Now we know that Meech will be dealing with the MKs in episode 8. He's back in Atlanta. We know Glock, he is running the show. I told you guys, it's a high chance that we may end up seeing the Angel character. And it is a lot of speculations about her character and what she's going to be all about. Will she end up getting close to Glock and using that as an advantage to help Meech out? Or will she really go up against Meech and say, you know what? Screw you. You know what I'm saying? You left me, so screw you. And that's it. We also know based off the trailer that Henrietta, she's looking very, very pissed off. What's going to happen? Will we end up seeing the family clash or will Henrietta end up finding out about Detective Veronica Jen? I do think Henrietta will still have issues with her pops when it's all said and done, but we're going to find out soon enough. Now, I told you guys in the What to Expect video that Meechie's about to have a fight slash shootout with Glock's right hand man. And he's been having issues with this guy since the very beginning of the season. The sad part is Meech, all he wanted to do was be cool with these guys. They all can make money and eat. But no, Glock says screw all that. His right hand man says screw all that. And they've been going back and forth ever since. I told you guys I believe this is the guy that's going to get thrown out the window in episode 8. Just based off that fight scene we're about to see and based off his attire, it definitely seems like Meech is going to get him up out of here. And we're going to find out if he ends up surviving or not. But I want you guys to leave your theories, predictions, leave it all down below. Let me know exactly what you think is going to happen in episode 8 titled Code Red. Expect the red dogs to turn up for sure and expect your boy Meech to figure out a different strategy to neutralize Glock and his organization. And also, I want you guys to let me know what y'all think your boy Terry is really going to be on. How will he handle this Vince character in Lucille? Who are you going to choose? Is it going to be Dr. Maurice or is it going to be Raw Doll Charles? It seems like Charles is about to drop a diss track. He about to pull out his Drake type moves and tell the doctor to drop him, give him 50. We going to find out in episode eight. But I will catch you guys later on for the quick thoughts, early impressions. So stay tuned for that. But I want to thank you guys once again for all the love, all the support, and I will catch y'all on the next one. But let me get up on out of here, man. It's your boy Mark Dark. I'm out. Peace.